For this video drum lesson, I want to pay tribute to the great drummer Clive Burr from Iron Maiden by teaching how to play the drums to one of their classic hits, Run to the Hills. Sadly, Clive died this year, and it's a real shame because he was a great drummer, uh, perhaps um, underappreciated as well, which is always a shame. And uh, trying to learn this song for this video drum lesson, I've got a brand new respect for the man. I mean, I'm, I'm sweating like a pig here. Um, just trying to practice this song in order to teach you guys. So like I said, we're playing um, 16th notes, counting 16th notes, and we're playing those 16th notes on the hi-hat, double-handed, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, one E under, two E under, three E under, four E under. And if we take a look at the first bar, the intro drum groove, which is just one bar long, gets repeated every bar, um, you can see that the double-handed hi-hat notes stop on beat four, where it opens, so we get up to beat four, one E under, two E under, three E under, four, that hi-hat rings open, it stays open, and then we hit the floor tom and the medium tom together on the and of four, and, and then when we go back to the drum beat to repeat it again on beat one, the hi-hat closes again. Up to speed sounds like this. Then it comes in. So the drum feel very, very simply is four on each drum, and I've got four toms on this kit, so I'm going to play right, left, 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 right, left. With the bass drum coming down at the beginning of each of those drums. Bass drum, bass drum, bass drum, bass drum. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Now, if you've only got three toms, then you could play I don't know one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Play the last eight notes on the floor tom. If you've only got two toms, then you could perhaps go one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Or even use the snare drum, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Whatever you want to do to make as many different sounds as possible. But I'm lucky on this kit, I've got four toms, so I can play each of those individual sounds on the different tom. But if you haven't, then use your common sense. So it's this, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Ta-da! And then what Clive does, a really cool lick, he plays the fuddler dump. Whee! Fuddler dump back in the song again. And we're looking at bar, uh, the very last bar of the song now. And what we've got is a group of triplets. I won't worry you too much about the technical nussness of it. What we're going to play, we're going to play four notes starting on beat one and ending on the and of one. And all four of those notes have to be smooth. We're gonna play right, left, right, bass drum. Snare, high tom, floor tom, bass drum. <laughs> 